David Epstein is probably most known for his Square One accomplishments. He is a uh, an excellent Square One solver based in Australia, and he has held the Square One OCR for both single and average uh, for quite many times now, but he is also an amazing 3x3 solver um, for that matter, and today he just got a 384 second single, which I will be breaking down in this video. He's going to start with a white X cross setting up to the uh, first pair, uh, sorry, the second pair, and this inspection actually contains quite a lot of planning and also uh, smart efficiency. So I will also explain these in detail to you. His cross pieces are here, 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 and here, and we also notice this block, which will correspond to this edge. Now, if you notice, we will solve the if we just solve the cross normally without any consideration of the X cross, we will just solve this edge, and then solve these two like so. You can notice that that preserves the block, and this corresponding edge, however, is not in this spot, but moved uh, an F2 away. So an idea is that we can just move this first layer from F2 first, and then after we do those moves again, we will be able to solve this edge to its correct position, and that will be an X-cross. It's a very common technique in X-cross building, where you basically plan out the normal cross solution and see how some pieces will end up and then you can plan out your x cross solution from there by doing a pre-setup move and then doing the cross solution but moreover david also saw his second pair which is going to be these two like so and first of all this execution is not quite pleasant especially uh for the pickup of the solve and also um he's going to notice that if he does it from this angle so that would be f prime and then r2 to set up this edge and then b2r not only is this much better for execution, but he also notices this, this corner and this edge can actually be set up after we do B2. It can be set up with a U, and now when we bring up uh, this edge while solving the X cross, we will have set up these two. So that was a very uh, interesting and also very efficient planning. I think you guys should learn a lot from that first two pair solution. And now just regular third pair and fourth pair. And now unfortunately here, David got a very massive lock up uh, preventing him from getting his pp single according to him but this is just a very easy last layer we have this ol and we have these two that are the same these two are opposites this is just a ol with a pl skip thanks for watching bye